I have enormous power as governor. Don't try me. Umayi wants PDP. David Umayi, a boy state governor, has warned member of the People Democratic Party, PDP, fighting him in the state that he has enormous power as governor. Umayi spoke on Sunday during the first stakeholders meeting of the All Progressive Congress, APC. He presided over since his defection to the party. He also retreated that he did not defect to the APC to contest for presidency in 2023. According to him, who dash monkey banana, I did not negotiate with the presidency or anyone to contest the position under the APC. My next line of action after my governorship is in God's hand and there is nothing God cannot do. Anyone wishing to contest for the presidency or governorship of the state should meditate and pray that God should not send him if God's spirit is not with such person. This is because it is going to be very tough and we are really in the end time, he said. He remarked that his administration will assist the PDP to survive the state. We will not allow the PDP to die in the state, but still assist its executive to survive. I am still the father of the state, and those fighting me for joining the APC should not cross the line. I will never confront a sitting governor while trying being his friend because the power of government are enormous, he also stated. Umayi announced the nomination of the immediate past APC chairman in the state, Mwachuku Eze, as commissioner in conformity with the agreement reached before the dissolution of the party's East Y State Executive Committee. We should set up committee at the wards and local government areas to regressively pursue our membership registration process and the disbursement of palliatives to our people in December, he added. Thank you for listening to this news. What is Dave Umayi trying to say? Huh? My viewers, what is he trying to say? Who is he trying to deceive? What lie is he telling now? He is still telling this lie of of um, his, his purpose of uh, defecting to APC. To, to APC. Dave Umayi should try to understand that he's not talking to kids. He's not talking to kids. If it is not because he wants to be a president, what then now warranted him or attracted him into defecting to APC? If that's not the reason. The first lie he told was because he saw the father in President Mulberry. He didn't see the father in President Mulberry when he contested as a governor under the platform of PDP and became a governor. Am I right? He didn't. Now that the party has helped him to succeed to become a governor of the state, he, is now, he, now, he now knows that the party is not it's not the kind of party that he should um, be a, a, a member of. This is human beings for you. So I'm not surprised. Human beings are bound to be like this and behave like this. You get it? They are bound to behave, to misbehave. So it's one of those things, my viewers. So, um, Dave Umayi, um, what I will just say is that um exercise the power that is influencing you because you have said that you have enormous power to control and to conquer 
exercise it because it's your time. You are in charge. But be careful with the toes that you step on because not everyone that you step on their toes are your match. You will have power, but your power cannot, cannot withstand the power of the Most High God because He is the one that made you the governor that you are. I'm not surprised because you are already in, 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 in APC. So maybe you have been inflicted with a virus. I am not a PDP, neither am I an APC. I'm just speaking as a neutral person for you to know that that statement you made is, is a wrong one, saying that you have enormous power. What power do you have? Is it up to the power of God? Is it? The power cannot withstand the power of the Most High God. He is your creator. He made you. He decided what you will be. So you don't, don't be boastful. You understand? So, I, 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 I said it before and I will still say it again, that you left APC by shutting the door so hard on yourself. And don't be surprised that your coming back is going to be difficult for that same door to be opened for you. You made a terrible mistake. You you understood politics, but you never understood it to the to the, to the, to, the, to the very best. You never understood it well. You see that? These are what you are saying. This is what we are talking about about our leaders. And their, and their deceitful, deceitfulness for power. You have deceived the people into voting for you and now you have abandoned them. It is well. Just knowing that all eyes are watching. All eyes are watching. And everyone knows all that has transpired between you and APC. You understand? Everyone has seen. Okay, so my viewers, Umayi cannot deceive us further. He can only deceive himself and his counterparts. But the truth will always be told, whether he likes it or not. You understand? Whether he likes it or not, the truth must be told. So, um, the people of Abion State, I would just say that it's a pity that they have you. So please, my viewers, do me to to leave your comments below the comment box. Click on the subscription button as well as the bell button to receive more updates. Thank you.